Hi, welcome to day three of the National Curry Week 2020 and Curry King when he is here. So today we're doing a chicken coma. I call it the easy chicken coma. The reason is, if you look at it, the number of ingredients it has is so minimal. But it's a beginner's chicken coma. You know, you don't you get all these ingredients easily available and uh, they're inexpensive and it makes a really nice coma and uh, for beginners it's the easiest one I would say so here uh, I've got all the spices lined up and everything so I'm gonna give an explanation about uh, how to cook this dish so follow us on uh, Curry's Made with these Facebook group as well so where I'll be posting one recipe every day to start with I'm taking a pan I've added uh, three tablespoons of oil and just uh, on a medium to high heat the first thing goes in as always this is like a you know the cooking process as well the whole spices but I've taken a cardamom a clove a bay leaf and cinnamon this is you know gives you like an aromatic the garam masala flavor if you're not too sure about the fragrance you know you can always like uh, take it out of the oil before you put the onion so and uh, so now I add onion I'm gonna make it uh, golden brown so in between that I'm just gonna add uh, some garlic chopped garlic about uh, one teaspoon so that's the strategy here just get the onion uh, nice and golden brown so as you can see it's like a super quick yeah and the garlic just to saute it a bit and add uh, one teaspoon of uh, ginger and garlic paste once the onions go uh, golden brown so tomorrow I'm gonna do like a green chicken coma and uh, so look forward to that and uh, I've been asked by a lot of people to do chicken tikka and the tandoori so which I'm gonna keep it for Sunday so Sunday I expect to see chicken tikka and a tandoori chicken recipe and uh, now you can see the onions going uh, slightly golden brown add the chicken so what it does it it stops onion go brown any further so you know that's how the trick works and also it helps is just get rid of the raw flavor of the chicken just to frying it a little bit now I'm gonna add some stock water and add uh, just a it's uh, here I've added about uh, 200 milliliter of stock water but I'm gonna reduce it now so what it does is it doesn't uh, like when you add the spices it doesn't burn and the spices get cooked thoroughly so you don't have the raw smell of the spices here I've added just a pinch of turmeric not a lot which is a uh, very good it's a superfood now which is, has all this uh, you know health benefits I've added uh, about half a teaspoon of uh, garam masala, half a teaspoon of uh, just a little bit more than half a teaspoon of uh, cumin powder and uh, I've added uh, white pepper because if you don't like it no spicy at all so this is the best way to do it adding a little bit of white pepper which gives you really nice taste without making the curry hot if you like it if you don't mind a tiny bit of chili do add a little bit of chili and don't ever listen if anybody say you can't use this in a curry curry is personal you can do what you have with you and what's available for you so there is no such thing as this is how exactly the curry should be so just go for it if you want to have a coma hotter you can add a bit of chili it won't spoil it and but oh, I reckon you know you can try with the green chili it helps so now I've added another 200 ml of the base gravy just the onion one this one so I've added all that mix it and then uh, just uh, simmer it for uh, seven minutes yeah that should be it now you know wait till the chicken is cooked to check the seasoning so I put the lid on because it makes the cooking faster and also it stops uh, you know uh, all the droplets fall off the pan because it's always cooked on the high heat so always always check for the seasoning because the most important thing in the Indian cuisine is I've, I've ordered the salt now and uh, 
cream so you know generally when you add uh, cream in the dish so you always make sure you add the cream right at the end but in the coma we want to add the cream and butter about two minutes before so it's like gets thoroughly cooked you know it becomes it adds more creaminess to the sauce as well and uh, so where was I uh, it's about uh, uh, the, you know when they make a uh, uh, Sake. So, you know, if you add uh, the green chili paste or the green chili powder, it doesn't turn the coma into red. So, that's all uh, I was going to say earlier. So, please do join on this revolution of cooking curries made with these on Facebook group. So, and uh, eat curries and be merry. Curry King Winnie, follow us on Instagram, Aztec Curry King Winnie, Facebook, Curry King Winnie, and Twitter at the rate of Curry at Winnie. Enjoy!